she got ghosted on freaking vacation. Okay? Now, I mean, I, I, I don't know. Stephanie, you can hit that when you're ready. She must have done something crazy for that but time. Listen, listen to her tell the story, okay? okay? Just hit it, hit it. Listen listen to her tell the story. This guy flew me to Miami for our like second date for like a vacation thing, and I'm pretty sure he ghosted me while we were here. Like, he left. I have no idea why, and I really, I know this sounds like naive, I really don't think it was anything I did, but TBD, because I don't know why he left, or when he left, or how. He, he drove, but whatever. We're gonna call him Michael for the purpose of this story. So yesterday, Michael was like, oh, I'm gonna go get lunch with my sister really quickly, I haven't seen her in two years, I'll be back at noon. I was like, okay, cool, just don't forget, we have these hard to get lunch reservations at 1.30. He's like, yeah, I'll be back before then. So I went to the pool, minded my business, you know, soaking up the sun. At 1.10, I was like, hey, where are you? Like, don't forget about lunch. No answer. And then at 1.20, I said, where are you? Like, are you picking me up for lunch? Because he, he has his car here. Like, he drove a couple of hours away from Tampa. And I was like, hey, like, where are you? Then I started getting really frustrated, and I texted him something like, yo, this is just so disrespectful to me and my time, and, like, blah, blah, blah. And he's like, hey, sorry to be non-responsive. I just found out some devastating news. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm a very... Um, caring person. I don't think that's the word, but oh, I'm a very trusting person. So I was like, oh yeah, like something happened, which to this, to this time, I feel like something still happens. My friend don't think that something happened. Though. They're like, oh, he definitely has a secret wife. He was like, get your ass home. But it gets worse. I pushed the reservation back to, he misses that reservation too. And like, this is before he told me he had this quote, devastating incident. And, and then what? And it ends there because I watched the whole fucking video. You don't want to. You didn't want to see the rest of her. No, story? I didn't. I didn't know that the video was incomplete. I figured uh, I listened to the rest of the story on the show. Okay, and I can't find that shit damn, no more. Damn, I want to know what happened. Yeah, but apparently she was ghosted. Okay. But who does that? Uh, a lot of dudes do that. Like he took her to my. Like if I flew you to Eugene, right? And I'm supposed Here to be spending the weekend with you in Eugene. Here we go. And then all of a sudden. And then you get the ick, I do something, I'm, run, I'm running not with Not even get the ick, you know? Then, you know, freaking named the actress, I don't know, uh, freaking Halle Berry or. It's not gonna be in Eugene. You Oregon. know, showed up out of the blue. It's not it's gonna like, be, that's not even a realistic I'm just, story. Okay, fuck, forget Halle Berry. I'm just saying. A hotter girl, just say that. Okay. But I don't want to make you feel bad. A beautiful lumberjack girl in Eugene. Yeah. Okay, period. <laughs> a hotter girl, okay, okay, who's more interesting, got her shit together, okay, and thick, <laughs> okay, and she's like, hey, you know, um, Sky, why don't you spend the weekend with me? All right, then I have to call Shayla up and be like, uh, then you just have to, then you look, go. Something very important came up, okay, uh, my sister's parakeet that we grew up with is dying, and. I have to go. Sister parakeet that <laughs> yeah. we grew up with. Yeah, you yeah, know, the parakeet was a big part of our family. It raised me. Okay, you know something part go. of the story is not realistic? <laughs> what? She might be hotter. She might be thicker, right? And she might be a lumberjack. I just do the thicker thing and then it make the big girls. She might be bigger. hotter, thicker. She might have her life more together. And she might be a lumberjack. But there is no fucking way that she's more interesting than me. I refuse to believe that. I think I'm the most interesting person ever, so. Mm -hmm. Cool. Ain't nobody gonna show up and be more interesting than me. Come on. That's the piece that stood out to you. That's the piece that bothered you. Yes. Shit. You, you can't, you can call her hot and all that stuff. Okay. We're interesting. Sorry, sorry, okay, my bad. That Listen. is a dig like no other. There's a girl who showed up. She's nowhere near as interesting as you. Period. But she's a much better option. Period. And I'm going this way, okay? But she's a much better option, so, okay. How you get back home, I don't know, I'll okay? I suggest you get a Motel 6 is one of them by the free rate. They had a couple murders there, so keep your door locked. Okay. <laughs> Here's a nickel. <laughs> I'll be like, you can't get rid of me, so it's, it's, it's the three of us this weekend. What's up? <laughs> now what? I'm just saying. Okay. Now you got both of us. Okay, I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So it's, it's probably easy to get ghosted. And she looked like she might be a little annoying, homegirl. Who? That girl who's telling the story. You think so? Kind of. The way she talked was yeah. like, she talked really big with her mouth. Yeah. Brittany this said, guy flew me to Miami for our yeah. like, second date for her, like a vacation thing, like, and I'm pretty sure he ghosted me while we were here. Like, <laughs> <laughs> damn. <laughs> full of hate. Stephen, do me a favor. Guy flew me to Miami and ghosted me. To Google that and let's see if we get a full video. Brittany said, I think most are interesting when they speak less. <laughs> All right, Brittany, I'll, I'll, I'll keep that noted. Guy flew me to Miami and ghosted me. 
I will keep that noted, Brittany. Speak okay, up. okay, yeah, yeah, there it is. Look, hold on. Let, let's see. But, but, um, Stefan, Stefan's checking because we might have the video. She flew to Miami to get her cheeks clapped and instantly regretted it. No, just like a... Let, let's, let's see. Okay, we're lucky. That's, we, we got it, but it's other people doing getting ghosted in Miami. Click on that. She doesn't want to date that Go up, guy. go up, go up, go up, go up. Up, up, right there. Click on that. I'll date a guy that's more down. interesting, but there's no girl No, down, right there. Click on that. Okay. Not more interesting. That's the worst. Yeah, okay, there it is. Like, let's click on it. She, it has three million views. And one. she has an update. Okay. This one. Yeah. So let's... So download that. Okay. Hold on, let's make sure that's just her in the video and no one else. So slide, slide the timeline. Slide more. More. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Her, her, her mouth is so okay. big in the camera. Okay, <laughs> would you stop hating on the girl's mouth? I'm sorry. You're kind of petty, that's why you ain't got a woman right now, okay? Because you work with a little shit. It's really... Her mouth is I too big. I wanted her to like take the camera a little bit. I can't date her because her mouth too big. I never said that. Okay. No. I don't like big mouth girls, okay? <laughs> when you were like, what, what do you mean, Shayla? She talks too much? She tells Dean, me too much? Dean said, Shayla, you're about as interesting as burnt toast. Uh, damn. Okay, burnt toast is interesting. <laughs> damn, that was harsh. Okay, guys, we found it. Let's see. Okay, here goes. The Let's internet see. is not a nice place. I know. They mean, right? Yeah. Okay, guys, here goes. Okay. Guys, this guy flew me to Miami for our, like, second date for, like, a vacation thing, and I'm pretty sure he ghosted me while we were here. Like, he left. I have no idea why, What's and I promoter? really, I know this sounds, I like, know. naive, but I really don't What's think it was anything I, I did, here. but TBD, because I don't know why he left or when he left or how. He, he drove, but whatever. We're going to call him Michael for the purpose of this story. So yesterday, Michael was like, oh, I'm going to go get lunch with my sister really quickly. I haven't seen her in two years. I'll be back at noon. I was like, okay, cool. Just don't forget we have these hard-to-get lunch reservations at 1.30. He's like, yeah, I'll be back before then. So I went to the pool, minded my business, you know, soaking up the sun. At 1.10, I was like, hey, where are you? Like, don't forget about lunch. No answer. And then at 1.20, I said, where are you? Like, are you picking me up for lunch? Because he, he has his car here. Like, he drove a couple of hours away from Tampa. And I was like, hey, like, where are you? Then I started getting really frustrated and I texted him something like, yo, this is just so disrespectful to me and my time and like blah, blah, blah. And he's like, hey, sorry to be non-responsive. I just found out some devastating news, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm a very um, caring person. I don't think that's the word, but oh, I'm a very trusting person. So I was like, oh yeah, like something happened, which to this to this time, I feel like something still happens. My friend don't think that something happened. Though. They're like, oh, he definitely has a secret wife. He was like, get your ass home. But it gets worse. I push the reservation back to two, he misses that reservation too, and like this is before he told me he had this quote devastating incident. And and so room service, or not room service, housekeeping, and I promise this is important, housekeeping ends up coming, and I was like, okay, like this is at 3.30, I think. I was like, you can come on in. And after they made the bed, I took a nap. And so obviously they cleaned the shower too, which is important. And as I'm getting ready to go hang out with some of my other friends, I was like, fuck this. And I think this is still before I knew what happened. Actually, I think I knew that there's this, quote, devastating event. And so then I look around and I look in the corner and I realize his stuff's not there. I was like, did he come get his stuff while I was taking a nap? Like, that is so disrespectful. And there is the possibility that he possibly got it while I was at the pool and he was supposed to be home by noon and, like, all of that. Um, that could have possibly been when he got it, but I don't know because we're both very clean when we travel. So our stuff is, like, very compact. It almost looks like somebody's bedroom. But if he did get it while I was napping, that's disrespectful. And I noticed this morning when I was showering that there was a washcloth that was wet in there. I was like, did he get his stuff and then shower? Because housekeeping would have cleaned it up yesterday if he had showered before they came. And I was like, what the fuck? I was like, that would be so disrespectful. My friends like, were you sleeping through all of this? I was like, yeah, I'm a tank. So not quite sure what's happening right now. Keep you guys updated. Um, I'm going to go run up some room service. Anyway, here's the first of many pina coladas on his tab. Thank you. <laughs> I hope she ordered a bunch of more pina coladas. Wait till he fig wait till she figure out. I wanna hear I wanna know what the update wait is. Wait till you wait till she figure out like his card don't cover all that shit. There's, a, there's, a, there's an update video. Uh -huh. He double book. I've done that before. I think he did that too, Rocky. Oh, like right now. I think he did that too. 
<laughs> no, no, there was an update video too. I want to know what, what the update is on her TikTok. Yeah, update right right next to the right. Yep. This one. Mm hmm. Okay, hold on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jesus. She, I like her in the update video. Poor girl, though. That sucks. I would hate for that to happen to me. <laughs> or would I hate it, though? It depends on how much I like the guy. Because <clears throat> if I didn't like the guy that much, I feel like, whatever, I'm just going to enjoy this time by myself and make some new friends and stuff, you know? It might end up being a really good solo vacation. Could be. Honestly. That is true. Yeah, we're going to yeah, show if that, you make that If you make the best out of it, then for sure. Okay. So let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're about to. Um, this is the update. Supposedly, let's attention. see. Attention. We have an update on the guy who ghosted me while we were on vacation together. Thank you to the TikTok girlie who figured this out. I'm not going to put her username because I don't want her to get in trouble with how she I can't hear both of the videos so, are playing at the same time. Now we. Okay. All right. Now that is that part. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's see what's up. Update video. Okay, update video, homeboy. Attention, we have an update on the guy who ghosted me while we were on vacation together. Oh, that's what she looked like when they heard about. I'm not gonna put her username because I don't want her to get in trouble with how she got the information. So now we have the deed to his house, <laughs> and it turns out that there is a woman's name on the deed to the house who happens to have his last name, even though he said that he was divorced like years and years ago, and that he did have a long-term girlfriend, but like he said they didn't get married. This woman clearly has the same last name of him, as him, oh. and she's on the deed to his home, or shall oh. I say, their home. Anyway, now we have all of their email addresses, phone numbers, home address, which I don't need those so things per se. Actually, no, I just I just don't need those things, but phone numbers come in handy. But because her name is very unique, like I've never heard of her name before, she was very easy to find. So I found her Instagram and I had one of my guy friends follow it. So we're still waiting for that update of him following it. She has like a good number of followers. She has three 3,000 followers for not that many posts. Like not really an Instagram girly, but I hear that's a good metric. So yeah, I guess I'll have more updates once she accepts uh -huh. my friend's friend request. But I'm excited. So, I mean, I know what she looks like. Yes, She's I'm around his much. age, which makes sense. When you search his name and her name together in Google, there are things that come up. Nothing related to a wedding, but huh. it is very clear that they are both on the deed of that home. Huh. I'll keep you guys updated. I was not expecting to get an update this early. So, yeah, okay, thank okay, you to TikTok okay. Curly, so who knows how Probably. to find things like then, this. You're the best. Now, would you want her? Would you want data? Fuck no, boy. That's too much. Why? Because she got ghosted and is getting down. Yeah, but if a dude flying you out, right? He ain't like, hey, look here, let's get married and settle fucking down. Flying out means that there's some smashing taking place, okay? I'm just saying. What do you understand flying out to mean? It's, it depends on the situation. Oh, sorry. That's right. You're about to get flown out. I realized I'm not going to be smashing, though. Oh, okay, cool. Congratulations. Good for you. I'm just saying, okay, in normal situation, notice how she tell you how interesting she is, but she is not going to be smashing. Anyway, I'm that just, has nothing to do with personality. I'm just saying, the man, fuck? a dude flying a chick out, it's not to have a fucking conversation, okay? Y'all could talk on FaceTime over the goddamn phone. They and had a hotel room together, though, so you think she was just talking too much and he got sick No, I'm just saying, like, just, just he might have not been into it anymore. And he's still fucked up because he should have done a better exit than that. Because clearly, he didn't know that she was going to go make a video, invite the whole world in, have it go viral, and then do an update and release all his information and shit. Why not say, mm, I'm not into this anymore, and just leave? Okay, why not be like, hey, I got ghosted and fucking, like, just yeah, leave it like that? Yeah. Why you got to go into all the details yeah, to bring the internet, all these internet sleuths in? Now the wife is involved. Yeah, you know what I mean? Now, like, dude, that's Now the deed on the house. house. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, that's too deep. She is doing too much. I, I, you I'm know gonna, what I mean? I would have definitely just, like, enjoyed my alone time. Because any dude watching this right now already knows you cannot fucking date her. Oh, if he smashed her already, he wouldn't have been able to get rid of her. Yeah, he probably dodged a bullet. No, listen, he didn't smash in this costume in his own life. Imagine if he did hit that. Oh, is she coming at you with a vengeance? I just don't. He could have just been like, dude, I'm, I'm not into this. I'm going to leave now. Yeah, Enjoy she, the fucking hotel. She has every you know? right to search for answers to why he did that. Congrats to her. Now move on. Okay, but Brittany, she has every right to search. Not to fucking tell us. It's one thing for her to know. She don't have to go public. Yeah, because eventually... I noticed what she said. Out. She started off well. this guy flew me out for a second date. For a second date, yeah. Okay, you getting flown out on the second date? Maybe he has money. Maybe he's a romantic. Ugh, dude. 
Maybe when the you, first date went so well that he had to. When have you get really flown out, date. there's some smashing. Her attitude is the reason he did. There's there's some smashing about to take place. She okay? kind of does seem like she's one of those girls that like doesn't shut up talking about the most mundane, boring. <laughs> like, you know, like she get she gives me that vibe oh. a little bit. You know, so mm. I don't know, but good for her for finding out the information, I guess. But yeah, she should move on. I wonder if she's going to bring up names because the internet is now going to want names. They're going to be like, who is this girl? <laughs> Screenshots, pictures. They could put it, what's the point of telling us the story if you're not going to give us the juicy details? Dude, they could put it together and his wife could put it together because clearly she has a very unique name. So if that's his wife, his marriage already fucked now. You see what I'm saying? Well, she told us, would you rather she hit up his wife and cause more internal problems? I mean, Brittany. the wife is going to find out. Brittany, the wife can fucking the, know. The, the wife whole is family know now. Yeah, the wife is going to find out. <laughs> the whole Don't family know now. Like, yeah. do it. Like, what are you supposed to do? It's, look, this isn't working out. I ain't feeling you like that. Let me leave you with this cash. You know, enjoy the room service. This is what, look at what Steven said. People don't, people can't silently take an L anymore. I agree. Damn the internet. That's so true. Everything is broadcast. So you do somebody wrong, they fucking put all your business out there. Yeah. You, Rejection listen, is foreign to I, women. Like I told you all yesterday, okay? I agree with Steven. The number one trait is, can she keep her mouth fucking shut? <laughs> okay? And that is, that supersedes beauty, personality, whatever you name, can you shut the fuck up? Because it's easy for stuff to go viral today. Doesn't she and seem like a talker though? And you don't want to be viral. So you need someone, no matter what happens in this relationship, you can keep your mouth shut. She's a talker. You know? Like, if we're going through a divorce and it's bitter, like, you're not... I don't not, need to be on the internet. They're posting every detail of the divorce. Right, That's you see what I'm saying? crazy. No, but really why would you, But why would you want everybody in your business anyway? It's yeah, like yeah. And then, and then you know, see, the, and the thing is, like, some people do stuff like that assuming that it's going to go their way. I can give you an example. Yeah. Okay? Now, I don't know how you all going to feel about this, but let's look at Johnny Depp, Amber Heard, right? They have issues, Okay? She took it upon herself to go write an article in the paper. You see how that fucking worked out? That destroyed both of them. Because he got it, fucked. It mostly destroyed her. No, both of them do it. Like, he's still around, but there's still a lot of girls who look at him differently as a result of some of the stuff that came out in that fucking trial. They're fr he lost fans because of that. And he lost Disney. He lost Pirates of the Caribbean because of fucking yeah. that. Because she shot on his pillow? No, it was more to it than that. She claimed that he abused he her, do, he did but, this. But, she, but he didn't do none of that. Yeah, but that was too late. Yeah, but dude, like, you gotta understand, once the accusation is made, yeah. motherfuckers don't sit there to hear the end result. Because when you accuse the dude, the truth don't come out till about a fucking year later. It's fucked up. You see what I'm saying? So it's, it's done. So, I mean, that's why you need someone who's gonna be like fucking, like, be able to handle stuff privately. That's my number said, one, that's my no. that's the first thing I'm looking for. G Can said, you shut the fuck up? G-Money said you gotta fly someone out who has a lot to lose if she talks. Yeah, but, but I mean, well, that's, well, I don't know that necessarily a lot to lose. It's just that like, it can't be the OnlyFans girl because they love fucking dramatic Talking. content. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So the OnlyFans girl would be like, I mean, just if you, you know, you were the guy. Shayla flew me out and she did, you know what I mean? It's gonna be fucking bad. Yeah. So you need people who, who understand A the, politician. Yeah, you need to, people who understand privacy. A politician. I'm invested now. I'm, I'm, I'm interested to see what happens, what, what unfolds. Well, the, his wife probably fucking left him. Well, I'm, I'm, the wife probably doesn't know yet. We're still waiting what for... What do you mean the wife don't know yet? The wife probably knows now. Now? This shouldn't have been viral. Oh, uh, for how long? I mean, I we're still waiting on an update video from the friend that followed her Instagram. I don't know, but you may never come back and do it. Who knows? I'm just saying. She likes to talk. She's gonna come back and update us. Yeah, and, and then she gets. Yeah, she's getting way too many views. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Years. That's another thing. Like getting so many views. Which is why you don't want the girl who want a bunch of views either. The best girl is the one. Okay, the best partner, not girl or guy, is the one who like. They might have social media, but they ain't involved and they ain't trying to go viral. Yeah. That motherfucker who's trying to go viral, <laughs> happy to go viral at your expense. Fuck, that's fucked You know up. what I mean? That's fucked. And you do not want that. That's crazy. People are just so willing to like destroy relationships and burn bridges. Sky, apparently Jerry Buckheimer said he would bring Johnny Depp back for Pirates of the Caribbean 6 if it were up to him. Dude, I would love to see Johnny Depp as Jack Sparrow, right? But there's a lot of people who can be like, no, he's an abuser. We can't put him in a fucking movie. 
Although, what's, what's that? What's that cologne? Swage or sage or something? Madonna. They still use him. They used him through this whole thing. They didn't fucking deserve Yeah, because it. it's or an or something. It's or not something. guilty until proven innocent. It's the other way around. I don't know, but he lost his case in England. Like, I mean, I'm just saying, like, that was complicated. And she initiated Oh, Christopher that. said just get a prostitute. She initiated Prostitutes probably keep their mouths shut, right? For most part. <coughs> yeah, but... Because you're paying them, so it's like... Yeah, but prostitutes aren't, like... It's not the same. Mm. Granted, granted, both of these things might be about sex, but a prostitute is like, unless you get like a girlfriend experience, like, you can't really make out with a prostitute, okay? <laughs> like, you don't make out. <laughs> like, they follow that Julia Roberts thing. <laughs> okay. you, you understand? Because there's a separation. Like, yeah, if you paid her enough, the, the price is... <laughs> no, because a lot of them, like, still, like, that's personal. Mm. Now, if you get a girlfriend experience, there's some of them who will fucking do that shit, They'll right? give you a girlfriend experience. But then you also know that she just finished kissing a dude two seconds before you, you know? How do you know? Because I just know. Hmm. Like, what, you are only client tonight? Unless you spend it, like, 15 fucking grand, chances are she just coming from someone else. But if you're flying her out, that's different. Oh, in a situation like that, yeah. yeah but yeah, I think if you fly her out, there's gonna be some making out. But, but then, she's coming from Paris. But then, okay, for, okay. Firstly, and then another thing, you might not necessarily want to use like condoms and stuff. You know? Why well, wouldn't you want to use a condom? I'm just prostitute. saying. You might like no, but no, but that's what I'm saying. That's making why, out with a prostitute is wild. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's what I'm saying. That's why you want someone it's a little bit more personal with, you know what I mean? Yeah. So you could like, you know, you could run on this one, right? <laughs> I hope she Make sure she's a clean prostitute first. Get the test done. Uh, yeah, then fly her it's, out. It's not gonna be like that. It's gonna be condom. I don't I don't I don't know. I don't know. I guess you could agree to anything and if you're paying big dollars, like I'm sure if Elon Musk had a prostitute, like he's gonna make sure she's clean and she gonna do stuff that probably Why a prostitute Why would Elon Musk meet a prostitute? I'm sure there's a bunch of girls trying to slide in his DMs right now. Yeah, but they might be talkers. Uh, he knows that this girl can shut the fuck up. Uh, facts. You understand that? Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Alright. Because I guarantee a lot of girls are there be like, oh yeah, go online. So Elon, I wait, met him at this party, wait, and then I flew back to his house, or even and he worse, was there. Wait till he's asleep and then do the little Yeah, 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 <laughs> catch, him, catch him sleeping catch and shit. Slip, what the slip. fuck is wrong with y'all, dude? I look at those pictures of girls doing that, and I'm going, oh my God, you just <laughs> fucked up. You just fucked up so much money because you got this rich guy in your bed. Okay, you take a who's gonna definitely hit you up again and now you're posting a picture on the internet? That dude can't go anywhere near you. Be fucking smart and shut the fuck up. DJ Bozak said, imagine being a prostitute in the mouth. <laughs> crazy. You know, it's crazy, man. <laughs> Don't kiss and tell, y'all. <laughs> Brittany. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I'm just saying, it's, it's, uh, it's, yeah, poor girl, you know? 